hi guys and welcome to day 20 of vlogmas we're still going we're still live guys the drama that has happened this morning let me start you off so six o'clock matt gets up and he's like oh the flight is cancelled and i'm like what so I get up from my sleep and I'm like, what do you mean the flight is cancelled? I don't, like, we checked in online last night before we went to bed. So he was like, oh, um, the flight is cancelled. So I look on my app and I'm like, well, it's mine. It's not showing anything. And I look into my emails and I've got two emails saying, yeah, your flight is cancelled. So me and Matt booked separately for our tickets. So um, just, you know, like we booked separately. So he booked his and i have mine so we're not traveling as like a family like two people we're on one booking we're booking on two separate we're traveling on two separate bookings so i'm like okay so i have a cancellation he has a cancellation it says our flight tonight is canceled and i'm and it says they've rebooked us to go from so originally we're meant to go direct from jfk to london gatwick and then pick up our car hire right and then so they've rebooked us to go from La Guarda, which is like a domestic airport here in New York, to Boston. And then from Boston to London. Not today, but tomorrow. I'm like, nah, no, that's not going to work. I'm not traveling tomorrow and I'm not going via Boston. Like, that's not a good alternative. I'm sorry. So I get on the phone and I'm calling them and I'm like, okay, I need to change my, I said, oh, I see you've, you know, changed our flight. Can I know the reason? The woman says, it's weather in London. I'm like, bullshit. I'm like, so how come all the other Gatwick flights, all the other London flights, there's no anything on the news saying that there's severe weather in London that we can't go. I knew, I mean, I've worked in the travel industry for a very long time. I knew straight away the reason why they bumped us off that flight is because we were showing in a system as two single travelers. So it's easier to bump off single travelers as opposed to like a family or, you know, like people traveling together. So I was like, okay, well, I'm not going tomorrow. I need to go today. I was like, I can go from, I mean, it was six o'clock at this point. I was like, I can go from this morning, this afternoon, tonight, but I'm not going tomorrow. So I need you to find something. So she's looking around and she's like, oh ma'am, there's nothing. I'm like, no, I, I, was, I, was, I was thinking, no, I don't think you're understanding. I have to go tonight. I am going tonight. You need to change my flight. You need to find me something. She's faffing about. I knew they have something. So she's faffing about, oh, okay, I can book you onto a flight tonight. 6.45 from JFK. Oh, look, magic. They have a flight. 6.45 tonight. And then you'll have to fly into Heathrow. So I'm like, okay whatever like at this point so basically there's two airports in um london and one they're basically opposite sides of the um of london so you know the one is in surrey one's in middlesex in two different ways so i prefer to go into gatwick because it's closer to home than in heathrow heathrow is just a bit of more trek to get home but if i have to i would go through heathrow so i was like i'd rather go today and go to heathrow than go tomorrow and still go to Heathrow and go via Boston so I was like okay that's fine I'll take that flight and I said to him to her before you change it I am traveling with my husband and he also needs to be on the same flight she was like okay cool so she's you know it's, it takes a while for her to reissue the ticket and whatever she's reissued a ticket I'm on the 6 45 flight tonight 6 45 p.m tonight and landing tomorrow into Heathrow at 6 30 so I'm like cool so she goes okay let me give me your husband's reference so I give her the reference and then she's looking, she's like, oh, the 645 flight's no longer available. I said, bitch, I'm gonna need you to find the flight. I don't care where you're gonna magic it from. I told you before you change it up, like you make sure there's two seats. I know from working in airlines that you can reserve the seats while you work on the other one. You can hold two seats. You know, she's working, she's not even like a travel agent. She is working for BA. So I'm like, oh yeah, we're traveling British Airways. And I'm like, like, don't take the piss. I was like, you know what? My blood pressure right now is about to be 2000. So I'm gonna need you to make sure that we're both on the flight. I said, you either change me. So he, she says, oh, I've got a flight for um, Matthew at 6.30 tonight. And I'm going at 6.45. Both of them from JFK, but 15 minutes apart. 
and I'm like that's not gonna work sweetheart like I need to be on the same flight as him so she's faffing about I said you need to put me in either you move him to the 645 or you move me to the 630 she's faffing about faffing about da 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 da, -da. and then she goes oh okay I'm, I'm okay and, you know after a while she's like okay I've put both of you on the 630 flight tonight from JFK and you get into Heathrow tomorrow so I'm like cool that's fine at least we're going tonight that's okay so I said to her, so for all this inconvenience, what is the compensation? Because just you changing my flight is not enough. I've already paid for the flight. This flight ain't free. So she's like, oh, I don't know what we can do, blah, 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 blah. So at this point, I'm just mad. I'm like, you know what? You're actually taking the piss. So I was like, can I speak to a manager? So Matt speaks to the manager and the ma and she tell he tells the manager, you know, we're going to have to pay for an extra bag anyway. We was planning on paying for an extra bag. So can you throw that in? Because you guys are not willing. So basically, when we get to London, we have to get a coach or transfer. We have to transfer basically from Heathrow Airport to Gatwick Airport, which is about an hour and 20 minute drive. And we have to get a coach, which we have to pay for with all our luggage so i'm like you're not gonna compensate us for that journey so you need to throw something in like i'm not asking for an upgrade i'm not being greedy but i need like something anyway so he says oh the uh the supervisor speaks to matthew and says oh let me see what i can do and i'll ring you back they did ring matthew back but he missed the call anyway i called them back and i was like okay you was gonna call my husband and tell him if we can get a free bag or whatever so i speak to someone else now i've lost the person that was speaking to the, the supervisor the person's like oh um uh the the person you know the person you're speaking to has gone home sure they have and you know you we can't add a bag free of charge for you on the on the system so I'm like, oh my gosh. I was like, whatever. So she was like, you can call the complaints department. Here's the number. So I'm like, you can't even put me through. No, we can't put you through there somewhere else. So I was like, okay, fine. Give me the number for the complaints department. So right now I'm about to have breakfast, finish packing and get on the phone with the complaints department. Somebody somewhere is giving me something for this inconvenience. So yeah. That's how my December 20th Vlogmas Day 20 started. Panic. First of all, I think I'm not going. So now I'm grateful. Don't get me wrong. I'm grateful that I'm going today and not tomorrow. But like bumping us off the flight and giving us an excuse of weather is not acceptable. So I'm just... I'm... <sighs> so annoying. But... Um, I am having some overnight oats that I made yesterday and they have um, oatmeal, some milk, some berries, some nuts. Um, I've got some berries on top as well as you can see some frozen berries that I had in the freezer. Got peanut butter in there, I got flaxseed in there so I'm gonna eat this and then get on the phone to BA. I'll let you know how it goes. Back. <laughs> Just advised to travel to Greenland. So there's no vlogging going on. But... London. 